Hi, just a quick video today about JLC PCB's assembly service and they've not really published this but they've made some changes to their SMD assembly service. First of all you can see this PCB that I've had here which I'm going to cover in a video shortly but this is a black PCB that has been assembled using JLC PCB's assembly service. So as you know it has been restricted to green PCBs up until now but they're now offering assembly on to black PCBs but two layer only. So that's the only option that they offer for different color PCBs at this moment in time. So if you take a look at the website, further down here it's got the assembly capabilities. You can see now it says two layer in green or black solder mask in one, 1.2 or 1.6 millimeter thickness. Now the limitation in color is nothing to do with the equipment that they have, it's just that their operation is streamlined for green PCBs because aside from all of the prototype orders, they obviously produce a lot of PCBs for commercial orders and for OEMs in China. So it makes sense for them to extend that capability to prototype orders to keep the cost low. Black is their next popular colour, so they've obviously added that as the next one and I expect we'll start to see some of the others creeping in in due time. And then we've got the four layer green PCBs, that was there before in one 1.2 or 1.6 millimetre thickness, but they've added a new option here, six layer green PCBs in 1.6 millimeter thickness and that will please a lot of designers who want to create high density PCBs especially since they have now added BGA parts into the component library so you can get some really complex PCBs made and assembled at JLC PCB. And then one other change which they haven't put up here for some reason they've hidden it down in the FAQs but they now support 20 different types of extended parts on each PCB whereas previously that was 10 and it was sometimes quite restrictive on your boards which meant that you either had to compromise on the design or you had to order the parts separately and assemble them on the board yourself. So now you can get more parts assembled onto your PCB. So that's just a little update on their assembly service. Also you'll start to see some updates on the website. They are making changes. When you log into your account, you'll see that the layout is completely different and there's some new options as well as more detail available as you place your order. So hopefully you found this video useful and until next time, thanks for watching.